I'm joined now by some of the team from the Game of Thrones. They were taking a session in the big screen. So how did that go? It sounded like it was epic. Absolutely epic. Yeah, I mean, this was the first time that uh, an episode from uh, season eight was seen in both uh, Dolby Vision uh, HDR and uh, Dolby Atmos uh, surround. So it uh, sounded absolutely epic and uh, looked amazing, especially uh, an episode that takes place uh, mostly at night uh, benefits uh, hugely from amazing contrast of uh, HDR. So it was really, really fantastic to see it that way. Even though I'm sure you've seen it a thousand times, as the producer, that must have been brilliant to see it like that. Oh yeah, it is really fun. It's fun any time we have the opportunity to, to see it with an audience, and to project it really big and to to do it in that venue, because the venue here is really spectacular, um, was a lot of fun. They seemed to really enjoy it. So what innovations were used in that episode? Wow, well, our visual effects team um, uh, used a lot, of, a lot of spider cam, which was a relatively new tool for us, um, you know, which is a, a motion control repeatable movement camera that can work whenever you have you know, dragons or point of views from people on dragons flying over. Um, there's probably an awful lot of uh, warm clothing technology <laughs> that poor crew out there 55 nights in a row in Northern Ireland shooting it. Um, a flamethrower, lots of people in green suits. Yeah, all, all of that. <laughs> and, then, and then actually, you know, in the theater, Dolby Atmos and, and, and Dolby Vision, to see it remastered that way yeah. was, was a real pleasure. And what were you talking to the audience about specifically? Yeah, I mean, I think it was interesting because there were a lot of questions about how do we produce something at this scale. Um, you know, over the course of the uh, entire series of Game of Thrones, we shot approximately five times the Lord of the Rings uh, trilogy. So just the, the sheer amount of volume, how do we deal with that season after season, and then evolving the idea of taking a show that in the very beginning was very simple up to something that was a visual effects uh, sort of epic by the end. Well, gentlemen, thank you so much for talking to us. It's been brilliant. Thank you. Thank Thanks. you.